Ooh. You guys think we can take on a, a wolf pack now? We have gotten significantly stronger, haven't we? We're big boys. We can do this. Yep, yep, we're good. We're good. Good stuff, good stuff. Gotta stay up with the stamina. Oh no, I totally screwed that up. Run, run, run. Oh man, my finger slipped on it. I thought I was getting better. Oh, 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 run away. Run so fast and far away, please. Oh, we need to hold on until we can put our potion. Yes, okay, got our potion. Run! Good grief, good grief, good grief. They're so fast. How are you still following me, dude? Go away. Ugh, he's growling his right in my ear holes. Can you stop? Thank goodness. Okay, let's go get our freaking winnings from those two. Okay, you know what? We can take you now. Nice. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Good stuff. Okay. Sheesh. That took a lot of our life out, though. No doubt. My goodness. All right, what is going on, everybody? My name is Notorious Crisco, and this is episode six, I believe, of Pax Day. If you enjoy this video, please take a moment and leave it a like. It really does help me out on YouTube, get more people to see these videos. If you have anything fun to talk about, tips or tricks, please leave them in the comment section below. And then, if you want to see any more Pax Day or just more videos by me in general, please go to my YouTube, Notorious Crisco. Hit the subscribe button and then hit the bell icon. That way you're updated anytime that I post a new video. But last we left off, we had finished a wonderful conversation with our best friend over here, Titus, and he helped us figure out how to get this blacksmith workbench. All we needed to do was do some uh, raw iron sheets, and voila, and that has opened up a wide range of goodies for us, and I am so excited. I mean, look at all this stuff, dude. Look at all this stuff, it's so crazy. And once we get this, uh, this, where is it? Right here, the armor smithing tools, as well as the weapon smithing tools, it opens so much. I'm telling you, we're probably gonna have a plate here in, in no time flat. But the last thing I made the other day was an apothecary table, or apothecary tools, and then I made the, the jewelry smither over there. So I just wanted to put this down with everybody and see. So, okay, okay, so extract from Lodos Tears and Dadara fruit. Okay, so then real quick though because we need the other thing right this guy rough glass ah, dang it we're out of rough glass for that oh no okay well i was already planning on it but i gotta run all the way back through uh through the mountain over there and uh yeah we gotta get ourselves some sand we gotta get ourselves some uh iron and copper and tin all the stuff we gotta get all this stuff here so that's exactly what we're gonna do because i, I wanna i think it would be good to start i mean everybody else is making potions right now so it's not super necessary for me to do it but you know what ah, might as well right we might as well learn there's no harm in it. All right, well, we are off. Time to go and grind, boys and girls. <laughs> Should be pretty easy, though. And hopefully no one's around, so we'll be able to get the bulk of everything uh, over there. Let's see, what's the map looking like? All right, so we got Skaldor and Air online. All right, that's not bad. That's not bad, dude. It's fine. It's fine. They're all the way over here, so they're not going to mess with us. Ah, so you want to ruin my day there, Mr. Wolf Face? Oh, he didn't even want to fight me. That's right, we got to work on our shielding. What? How did he hit me? There we go. I think the other, the other shield protected better. Is it saying 2.313, right? So does that mean that out of 13, I'm only getting 2.3 taken from me? The other one was like 1.1. Oh, ah, dang it, I missed that. Ah, boy, he packs a wallop, eh? That's all right. Hey, oh, also, I want to know what these uh, Fury Collar Stones are. I feel like they have something to do with enchantments. Am I am I right about that, or am I am I wrong? I don't know. They just feel like uh, stuff in other games where it would it looks like you combine this with something else on an enchantment table, and then you create an enchantment or something. I don't know. I don't know. Just just hopeful hopeful thoughts man you know my my ultimate goal would be to open up a blacksmith shop of course um or a smithy in total yeah a, a full-on smithy weapons armor uh regular stuff and then to be able to sell enchanted weapons and armor that would be the freaking coolest dude um it's it's an ultimate fantasy i have since starting this game i think that would be the freaking coolest man just make the strongest swords of all time plus then you can make them a little more original than you know uh just just this 
wrought iron sword or a large wrought iron sword or whatever you know because then you could have like a, a fire enhanced one uh mixed with uh an ice or a freeze type one i think it would be really cool so hopefully hopefully i mean it's early access so they got tons of time and tons of potential and i'm looking forward to it i hope you guys are too for sure but boy this is the longest trek ever they really need to put horses in the game i'll tell you that i'll tell you that right now my legs are hurting oh my gosh Ugh, lose my breath before I even get to the top of this hill. What is this? So far away. That reminds me, are there agility potions in this game? That'd be kind of cool, right? You go a little faster, get a little bit of a movement speed buff. Whew, they better put that in. Oh my gosh. Trucking it is taking forever. Hiking it, I guess you'd say. But you get, you do get to see the progress throughout the map, which is kind of nice. Also, I found out, um, I'm not sure if I said this last time, but I found out that, hold on real quick, that these gates down here in the, in the very bottom to, uh, I think it's called Lioness. That's where the PvP is. So um, I've talked to some of the guys, and uh, they're all they're all still obviously uh, getting their skills up right now and stuff. But uh, a lot of them say that they're they're down. They're down to go and because uh, you have to go in there to get pure iron anyways. So we might as well make it a whole clan event kind of thing and go in there and wreck face and get all the pure iron we can. Don't know when that'll happen. Of course, it's gonna be probably a little bit. It is still relatively new. Everything in here. And not only that, I mean, everybody's still kind of weak because we're focusing more on our crafting uh, than our... Oh, look, somebody getting hit. What's what's that wolf doing? What are you doing, wolf? You want to die? Oh, it's Elizabeth. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Got to be nice to the, the neighboring citizens. The area looks really, really cool, though, so far. I really love this trade building here. And then there's another one over there, the one that says not open, but then has a chest. I think, ah, oh, man, people are just doing great things great things just imagine what this is going to look like in like a month even or two months or a year if they continue adding stuff to the game well fine don't say hi back i know you're fighting a wolf but geez it didn't probably didn't take it that long to beat it up right could have at least said hi i mean gosh dude i was trying to be nice but i guess not big jerk oh what is that over there oh look at that it's a little windmill oh is there gonna be loot in there you think guys oh that'd be so cool is there a way down there safely oh <laughs> Doesn't look like there's a safe way down from over here. Can you guys even believe how huge this map is? It's crazy. I want to go up there. That seems like it's going to be cool, man. Okay, on the map, it looks like you can go around like this here. But is that actually on the other side of the water there? Oh, it looks like it's right here. Oh, man, there's a huge mountain right How do you get there? It's got to be like a, a hidden, um, hidden route to get there, I bet. Oh, that'd be cool. We got to figure that out soon. Dang it. My friggin' pick died right as we were finishing. That's a pretty good haul though, huh? It's not too bad, honestly. Check this out. Look at these. Look at these guys. Look at how difficult it must be to do archery. They're sitting at the, the wolf spawn point just so that they can hit him every single time from right above. <laughs> Maybe that's the strat though. Ah, okay. All right. Well, we learned a little uh, life hack here for uh, getting the bow up. That's great. That is great news. Because man, that was going to be a huge pain in the butt to do. Well, that is uh, just genius. Genius life hacks for the PAX Day universe. I'm, I'm proud of them for figuring that out because now we get to do that. They said you'll need hundreds of arrows, lowest arrow um, level as well as lowest bow level that you can use and just keep going. That way that the animal regens as a... Uh, as you hit it so genius genius i wanted to, I th they didn't answer if they had to uh get the plot for that to build that little podium i'm not sure if you have to or not i've never tried to build outside of my podium but i'm pretty sure you do i'm pretty sure you have to buy the plot of land before you can build anything on it so genius though we'll be doing that shortly nice we lucked out pretty hardcore with our blacksmithing here a moment ago we were able to get the worksmith and the armor in pretty much one go. I don't think I failed anything. Um, so let's just take a look. See, look at all this good stuff. Oh my gosh. Rot iron pickaxe. Really? Really? You know what? Hey, real quick, let's just go ahead and get us a thingamajig. Actually, wait, do we have any rot iron on us? Let's make an iron bar. Yeah, baby. Let's do it. Get us a rot iron pickaxe, huh? Are you kidding me? Get up there. Oh, of course. Right after I told you guys and bragged about now failing, I failed. <laughs> Dang it. That's all right. Is this done yet? Maybe? The glass, okay. No. No. No iron for your good guy. A little bit, a little bit of iron for me. Anybody got iron? Darn it. No. Okay. Oh, well. Let's check out the, uh, the armor table. What do we got on here? 
Oh, yes. We have plate. We have plate mail. Yeah. Let's go, baby. Okay. So, so. Just large iron sheets, iron studs, iron bands, rough leather bands. Okay. Okay. We can do that. We can do that. Let's put away this uh, fine wood real quick. We don't really need it right now. Also, real quick, I wanted to check out this finery thing. We might as well make it, right? I'll get our... Uh, what you call it up, our jewelry making, right? No, come on, you can do it. Nice, okay, perfect. What does this do for us, by the way? Small topaz amulet, okay. Six, four, six, does that give us anything? Oh, that actually makes us weaker. Ah, oh. and this one doesn't matter much, so we'll keep, we'll keep this one out, I guess. Darn, okay, so these iron sheets will make the large iron sheets, right? Where are they? Right here. Okay, we're gonna do that then. Make us some plate armor, you guys. Oh my gosh, are you excited? Cause I'm excited. All right, so what else What else do we need for that? All right, we need iron buckles, rough leather bands, generic leather. Oosh. Might need to go and uh, do some hunting here briefly. All right, we're gonna make us a little alchemy doohickey right here. That's what I think. Perfect, nice. Okay, so now we can make extracts. That's gonna be good, okay. Make extracts and then we'll bring them over here. Make it to potions. Oh, wow. Talk about weak. Well, that's how it goes when you start out. Makes sense. Jackplate, here we go. All right, you ready, guys? Check this out. First try, Frida, Frida boys. Dang it. <laughs> Everything fell all over the place. Ah, darn. Okay, well, we need to go get more iron and stuff. Very clear. First, let's actually go and break down some trees. Gotta make sure we got charcoal burn at all times. All right, so we got ourselves loaded up on our uh, wood here for the charcoalers and got all the charcoal from it. It has been a day um, since I went off to go do that, and they have updated the game. Um, in the patch notes, it says that all the uh, the chests have increased their capabilities and their inventory size uh, almost like by 10 for each type of different chest that there is. So I think I'm going to get some decorated wood chests um, and just start to prepare those for the big move because we're gonna we're gonna tear down this house and move right over there into that little area so we are gonna learn how to do the hinges and i need to go to here somewhere uh iron hinges so to do that we need iron sheets understood so let's make a bunch of iron sheets huh perfect another thing that they said was uh that was in the patch notes is the glitching with clothing would uh be minimal but i'm still seeing my uh my my robe through the cape every now and again they also say in the patch notes that you're like when you're attacking with a you know a one-handed weapon or two-handed weapon whatever that when you hit things you'll have a different motion so you'll see that here in just a second even if you're like hitting a axe on a tree you'll have some distinct motions that are different instead of it all just being you know cookie cutter exactly the same it's pretty cool actually i like what they've done with it um as well as like if you were to stun somebody they'll actually look like they're stunned which is really cool i, I like that if they continue doing stuff like that man we're we're gonna be happy campers for sure so let's go ahead and stop this and let's see how many iron hinges we can get out of this many sheets all right so we were able to get about 105 of those hinges which is friggin perf so now we are gonna take it over to the carpenter doohickey and let's make us some friggin oh i need planks too i almost forgot <laughs> but i did all right got ourselves the planks so now let us make some decorated chests that's it? Three? What? Oh, five. Okay. Still, that's not very much. I thought I'd have at least ten. Oh, screwed up. Oh, also, they said that you'll stop dropping your stuff on the ground, supposedly, and if you have open um, open inventory space. So we got five so far. We need more nails. Yeah, don't have any there. Don't have any there. We should, we should have some extra iron, though. I'm pretty sure, don't we? All right, so I made about 300, so let's see how many more that'll get us. Got our goodies. Let's go ahead and come over here. Where's the plot begin? Right over here. So let's go ahead and lay down all of these decorated chests. All right, so we put the majority of it down. That's perfect. We'll keep the hinges in here just in case we do want to make more. I said that there. Okay. On top of that, let's put away our charcoal. Oh, boy, that's going to take a hot minute to move everything over there. Truly. Truly it will. Yeah, man. So I'm thinking we put the main house like right here-ish. Ah, probably over there, actually. But what's unfortunate is that we have this tree that's going to be right in the middle of our house, sort of. Oh, two trees. So maybe we, like, make it come out this way and then cut in, come back this way, and then head back over. So kind of like a, a uh, L shape. 
in a way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we'll have this whole area be like a sort of a concrete or a stone pavement uh, with like barns and such. Kind of like what he's got there with the overhangs on it. I think that would be really swell. Gonna be pretty sweet. I am, I am super excited. But let me start moving some stuff over. Luckily, we don't have a whole lot. It'd be nice if there was a put all. Get out of your inventory. Oh, you can at least fast click it. That's kind of cool. Look at all that inventory space. Oh my goodness, that's so nice. All right, now we have gotten all the chests taken out of the house and put on the side there. And it's actually funny, exactly the right amount <laughs> of chests is what I put down, which is pretty awesome. So we're going to go on up to the top and get to work. Also, we're starting with nothing in our inventory besides a couple chests, so I do want to see how much uh, resources we even get back. Oh wow, I already have a full inventory, huh? No kidding. All right, so we got the we got the house torn down. So now I just need to. I shouldn't have put these chests here. That was a mistake. Because I do want to give him room in between me and him. Oh, dang it! Why did I build that right there? Dummy. Okay, hold on. Let's see what we can't do. Is there a way to make this go up? I feel like there should be, right? If you see how he's moving his pickaxe, he's going at different angles. That's so cool. I really like that they changed that. It looks so awesome. So you pay attention, watch. Comes at it from the bottom, top left, top right, bottom. That's so cool. I really like that. And it's the same for when you're swinging your, your weapons as well, which is pretty awesome. Uh, all right, so we got to go and get rawhide, but for now, we can make the grain mill. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're going to have bread soon, you guys. Let's do it. What is this? What is that? It's some sort of buff, but from what? What did I, how did I get this on me? I did just talk to our dear friend Titus. What is this doing? I actually don't know anything about the enchantments or spells in this game just yet. Uh, shh. Sh <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea what that is. Real quick, we're going to have to go and get us some large, you know, animal hides here in a second. But I do want to just see if I can make some pauldrons. Uh, all right, so we need iron sheets. So we actually are going to... Oh, did I, did I fail that a moment ago? Where's the grain mill stuff? I must have failed it. Okay, let's try it again. Get up there, you. You can do it. Get up there. You got this in the bag? Oh, no. Ah, oh, that was so close. That was so freaking close. Dang it. All right, come on. One more time. You got this. Get up there. Show them all the hard work you've been doing, big guy. Dang it. Come on, do it. Oh, boy, you guys. It's not looking good for us. Ah, I'm wasting so many materials. We're not even going to use this yet. Why am I doing this to myself? Yes, we did it. Okay. Jeez, or Louise, and then this one's going to be really hard, too. We do have to go and get ourselves uh, a little bit more uh, materiales, which is totally fine. We can go and do that. Oh, no. Oh, no. What happened to it? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Where did it just go? Oh, what? We've lost it. Oh, no. How did I do that? Where is... Oh, no, guys. The grain mill plans. What happened? I was putting stuff into this chest here, getting ready for us to go, and then it just sort of disappeared, but I heard a sound... It sounded like I dropped it. No. No. <laughs> That took so much work to do. Oh, Chris. Dang it. <laughs> no. Maybe it fell in the house. Let's go check the house. Which, oh yeah, I gotta show you guys the house. Duh. Jeez, just as I was about to show you guys the new house, my freaking, my computer blue screen. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, I don't know why. So um, I just had to go and do a bunch of driver updates and whatnot. But lo and behold, our new humble abode. Isn't it grand? Isn't it good? It's not too bad, right? It's a little big in comparison to like how Titus's is. I think his is a two by three. Ours is going to be a three by four. But I don't know, man. I like it. It came out pretty well. Uh, still getting a little funny uh, glitches on the long long beams up there on the top but i mean hey you know what for for what it is it's pretty slick i am gonna put a roof on the the balcony here um heading downwards and then of course we still have to sort of figure out our our landscaping down here obviously we're keeping this dock here um, i do have to repair it somehow i i think i screwed it up <laughs> if you look here i lost one of my posts and yeah yeah anyway we'll, we'll get that done some other time but let's show you the inside so oh 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 right here we're 
we're going to change this to a stone when we get it kind of like how titus has as well as we're going to once we get a nicer fence gate well or not gate just a fence we will put those on as well um and use those for windows i think that's a really slick look i do like how the you know the sunlight shines through it's not so freaking dark in here as well um so downstairs we are probably going to do a couple of crafting tables something like carpenter table um blacksmithing armory weapon smithing inside of the house maybe i'm not sure just yet because i want to have it to where like all the outside stuff like the charcoal kiln the forge the uh the kiln brick maker over there outside obviously our furnace is outside and then i kind of want us to have our our crafting stuff inside however that is going to be kind of annoying running back and forth i'm sure so i haven't fully decided just yet then we got the next floor here hello isn't this wonderful this will probably be more like a uh, storage and living area um kind of thing i'm not not 100 sure on this just yet either i just decided on the layout for the most part and it took forever to get this done um we do have an attic sort of area up here this is pretty slick huh look at this look at this this is gonna be strictly for hey, is that it yes oh i found the gray mill oh my gosh dude that was gonna be so how do you get all the way up to the third floor of our house what what in the world just happened with that that doesn't make a lick of sense anyways this is gonna be uh, a lot of storage up here i think it's gonna look pretty slick um I'm, I'm super stoked about it we got the little little windows right here a little, little window right here i can't put on a uh you see how that one has a a little square a, sh a short square wall right there i can't put that up there for some reason i haven't figured it out why um i did put a bunch of reinforcements throughout the whole house as you can see just from these beams right here i pretty much just did it everywhere i could um and still i was having problems with the roof and the uh the little square doohickey right there so i'm not sure why just yet but uh we will figure it out of course because we're so wicked smart and wicked good at this game you know what i'm talking about let's go ahead and put this down here before we lose it again like a fool and then we have to go and kill us some deer jerks a bunch of deer idiots <laughs> What a bunch of fools. Also, actually, while we're running through the town, a lot of stuff has changed around here. So I'll just give you a little look-see. A little looky-loo, so to speak. This guy's tore down his uh, his layout, and it looks like he's rebuilding everything. Um, kind of a lot of remodeling going around in the village, which is really cool to see. Um, oh, over here, if you look, we got ourselves another neighbor across, another neighbor across, a little bridge now, which is pretty slick. And then uh, I should have showed you while we were over there, but they, they've turned that into a, a like a miniature castle tower thing, which is kind of cool. Then we got all the stuff up here still. I think everything's relatively the same. Oh, no, actually, there's a, there is one thing that has changed up here, which is this little area as well as this little well gazebo, which is so cool. Look at this. Look at how cool. And then these are our clan chests, I believe right oh he had charcoal kiln plans you kidding me well shoot now we got one that's awesome oh wow look at all this stuff well cool we just got those charcoal kiln plans so now we don't have to worry about ruining things that's awesome got ourselves a nice little house here and a, a house across back here i wonder what this is gonna be honestly i'm not sure exactly what everything is i have been gone for a couple days unfortunately uh, i had to work through the night to get that house done so i didn't see anybody get on though which is kind of a bummer what is this is he making a dam are you kidding me he did make a dam oh look he's got the little anvil sign up there that's so slick that's so slick here's skaldor's place looking pretty spiffy huh look at it look at this it looks so good oh look people have freaking this is the grain mill i think right isn't it looks like it is yep grain mill so i can't wait to have one of those i can't wait to have one of those man that's gonna be so awesome ah i'm so stoked about our living situation going on over here but let's go kill these boars and jerks huh you know what i'm talking about let's go slaughter some boars <laughs> now we'll get some clay too uh-oh, here comes the wolf idiots. No, go away. Oh, I didn't put our uh, Healy heels on our bar. Uh-oh, Pischetio, that's not good. He doesn't want no business. You don't want no business with me, dude. That's what I thought. Wow, the music got really epic. Oh my gosh, calm down. What? Aren't there supposed to be boars here? What? Oh, is somebody going through and getting them? Regardless, I was going to take you guys up here anyways, because look at the tavern. Oh my gosh, this might be the coolest building on the freaking server. Look at this. 
Get ready for the grand reveal here. Oh my goodness. They've they've done such good work. Look at their fences that they've got going on here. Look at how slick this looks. Looks so cool, dude. Oh, wow. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh, man. They are so good. Titus and Sixtus are freaking so impressive. Like, look at, look at how they got their roofs done here. Look at it. That's a hard roof to make, man. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, there's no joke there. And then they got the, the huge chimney, which we still don't have a chimney for our place. So we are going to have to make one, unfortunately. Not really unfortunate. It's just going to be a little bit uh, tedious tearing down stuff and rebuilding. But ah, it is what it is. You got to do what you got to do. Also, I was going to ask you guys, if you if you know in the comments, just leave me uh, an answer. But like all the iron ore nodes that were over here, the veins are no longer there. I was wondering if they changed like the spawn location of them or something because i i've been up here all night oh gosh he's coming after us that's fine we gotta kill him anyways come here stupid yeah yeah there we go that's a nice block not gonna happen there jerk bag oh ah still not very good at the freaking the blocking game here come here goodies ah we can take him come here stupid huzzah you will you will perish here wolf Dumb jerk. Oh, I blocked that. I don't know how I'm doing the blocking. I'm, I'm not doing very good at it. See, so now look, up here is where the iron ore nodes are. And I don't know why. I feel like they have been moved. Um, there was a recent update. So maybe they, they changed it with the update? Question mark? I'm really not too sure. But eh, if they if they keep doing that, that would actually be kind of cool. If they, you know, they replace nodes every now and again. That way yeah, you're forced to go and explore more. Though it wouldn't make things uh, a little worse off for those that are like so used to going up to this hill to get their iron because this is my go-to spot for iron that's for sure and then over by the spawn point oh these guys are gonna come bother me aren't they i don't have enough health to fight all of them i don't think you can't see me you cannot hear me breaking this rock either let's get better ah here they come okay all right uh, run away Ugh, dang it they got me already die all of you you old poor idiots not today you will perish the thought indeed they did <laughs> Sweet, there's more up this away. Perfect, perfect, perfect. All right, so we got ourselves some iron going. That's good, good, good. Let's see, hopefully we can make some from this here. Ah, bummer, we're only gonna get nine out of that. Bummer, 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 bummer. We need one more. Oh, we do have one more. Perfect, we actually have a lot more. That's awesome. All right, let's get us some rawhide, eh? All right, so the rawhide is going to take about 15 minutes. We did get a bunch of generic leather, which is really nice. Really nice, mate. Anyways, we got ourselves some iron. We got ourselves some rawhide going. So let's just go out and uh, get some more hides for the future while we wait for that iron to respawn. And then uh, we'll go get some more. That'll be good. Come here, dummy. You're done for. <laughs> wait a minute. What is this? What's this? What's this mark here? Oh, it's gone. That was weird. I've never seen that before. It's like a bright, like, orangish, reddish. Oh, you scared me. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Come here, you stupid. Come here, you big dum-dum. Turn around. You're dead. Huzzah. See? Oh, it's, is that supposed to be blood? Why is it so bright? That's way too bright for blood. There's no way. But if it is blood, that's pretty cool. I've never seen that before. No, that's not blood. There's no way. It would be much darker than that, right? Wouldn't you think? I don't know. Maybe not. Oh, here we go. Here goes Here goes our next victims. Look at these dummies. You guys are stuck up there. <laughs> Aw, you're dead. Yeah, come back here. Oh, Do. one more time. Do. Oh, one more time. Yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's supposed to be blood. How interesting. Okay. Oh, look at these. Look at these. We got a bunch of other dummies down here. Psst. Berserker mushroom? Oh, that's the first time I've seen that. Oh, come back. Come back. I gotta tell you a secret. I gotta tell you a secret. Die. That was a pretty good secret. Come here. Where's... I got a... I got a secret for you especially, buddy. Oh, yes. Yeah. Sneaky little sneak. Got him. Super attack. Wow. Yeah, that's totally blood. That's so cool. Though they need to they need to tone down the redness uh, or brightness, I guess you'd say. Needs to be a little bit darker if we're talking about blood. Hey, look, some iron. I didn't know there was iron up here. That's awesome. Oh, dude, look at that. Oh, wait, don't fall off the cliffside, Chris. Hold on. Let's be safe about this. Wow, that's so cool. Look at this. How do you get stairs like that? 
Oh, are we gonna get curly stairs? We, we really gotta work on our carpentry. No doubt. No doubt in my mind about that. That's so cool, whoever did this. Let's go and check this out real quick. Look how cool. Oh my gosh, it's a winding staircase. Ah, so there's a, apparently a winery up here. Oh, look at this place. Wow, how does he have such a huge plot? Look at this little, look at this little area, huh? I have gone way off of uh, <laughs> the goal for today so far. But man, I saw that swirly staircase and I just had to go check it out. That's so sick. Is this the winery? I don't know. There's a winery somewhere. Wow, look at that building. That's gonna be sick. Is this it here? No, this just looks like a home. I like their roof right here. Oh, here it is. This will be the winery, I, I would imagine, right? Yeah, this has to be it, right? Because this, this seems like it's a little eating area, right? Yeah, this looks sick, dude. How awesome is this place, man? My goodness, everything just gets cooler and cooler as you, as you go along. All right, make sure you don't fall off the side of this, Chris. Man, how did they do this? You have to get some sort of like swirly stairs at some point. Because if not, he would have just used these long... Is that what he did for real? Did he just use longs? Uh, oh, oh, these long, uh, these guys right here that I'm standing on. The long, uh, man, what do you call those? Oh my gosh. The long floors the whole way up. Is that really what he did? Oh my goodness. That takes some dedication, dude. Wow. That's impressive. And I like these little chandelier, uh, chandelier street lamps. That's really cool. Oh, don't die. Ugh. All right, sweet. Let's get back to the group group grind though. You know, we got to kill all the animals and get any iron we can find. Finally getting the hang of using the uh, the special attacks a little bit, just a little bit. I'm glad that we're able to practice before we go and take this to the field of battle. Come here, dummy. That was unnecessary. I didn't need to do that for a fox. I kind of thought it was a, <laughs> kind of thought it was a wolf at first. Okay. Here, let's do it with the the shield this time. Come here. Come here. I want to show my friend something. Ah, I missed my second attack though. It'd be nice if you hit them. Uh, they started to slow down. Just in case you don't kill them first try. <laughs> like I whiffed on. Here we go. Check it out. Ah. Ooh, wrecked him. I was hoping to get both of them at the same time. Oh, well. Beggars can't be choosers. Ooh. You guys think we can take on a, f a wolf pack now? We have gotten significantly stronger, haven't we? What's our what's our combat levels at now? 17, only eight on our block. Yeah, we don't really block much, do we? Maybe I just pull one of them. Come here, Devin. Oh, they all came now. Run away, run away, run away. One forgot, here we go. Ugh, we can take them now. Nice, okay. We did all right there. We did run out of our stamina by doing that special attack. Get our stamina back. I think we can take them both this time. We're big boys. We can do this. Yep, yep, we're good. We're good. Good stuff, good stuff. Gotta stay up with the stamina. Oh no, I totally screwed that up. Run, run, run. Oh man, my finger slipped on it. I thought I was getting better. Oh, 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 run away. Run so fast and far away, please. Oh, we need to hold on until we can put our potion. Yes, okay, got our potion. Run! Good grief, good grief, good grief. They're so fast. How are you still following me, dude? Go away. Ugh, he's growling his right in my ear holes. Can you stop? Thank goodness. Okay, let's go get our freaking winnings from those two. Okay, you know what? We can take you now. Nice. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Good stuff. Okay. Sheesh, that took a lot of our life out though. No doubt, my goodness. Okay, let's get this Let's get this deer then, geez. Let's go back to killing things we can do easily. We need to get our blocking up so bad. Well, you know, we went all the way over there to get some rawhide and then we found a charcoal kiln plan. <laughs> so kind of unnecessary now, but you know, it's fine. It's fine, I'm not even upset about it. Honestly, I'm really not, I'm super stoked. Our neighbors are the best, truly. All right, we need Dotara seeds, actually, because we need to work on our carpet tree so badly we do. Because I want to unlock those stone walls, man. Jeezer. All right, we should be able to make all the flower pots now, I think, right? Right? Should be good? Yeah, all right. So let's make 14 of them. We got to go and search for some more Dotara pods or uh, seed pods right after this. Good. We're getting some good XP there. That's awesome. We need it badly. I want those walls, darn it. Could do these. We have tons of periwinkle, so let's let's go and get that. Actually, let's try to use everything that we can use before we go on another venture into the wilderness looking for uh, goodies. All right. Well, I'm gonna call it here, folks. Thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me today. I really do appreciate you. If you enjoyed this video, please take a moment and leave it a like. It really does help me out on YouTube. Get more people to see these videos. If you have anything fun to talk about tips or tricks please leave them in the comment section below and then if you want to see any more packs there just more videos by me in general please go to my youtube notorious crisco 
hit the subscribe button and then hit the bell icon that way you're updated anytime that i post a new video but besides all that thank you guys so 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 much i'm going to look for some dotara plants pretty sure they're over here in this forest somewhere but as i do that just know that i love you i appreciate you god bless you and bye